Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm planning the week of May 15th through the 21st in my Erin Condren Vertical Life Planner and you can see that it is a bit darker than it normally would be in the spring months and that is because this is the week of my fiance's birthday and I wanted to use a kit that reminded me of him and um what's it called? Supernatural is one of his all-time favorite shows so I decided to use this Wayward Sons kit from Whimsical Plan since it is a Supernatural's theme and I decided to pull in this like I forgot what she called it it's like a really dark blue almost black shiny foil from School of Prince Co that bundle and then I also pulled in some silver foil to kind of use as my core so black and silver were the two colors that I used for this kit and I think it worked out really well and I also pulled in some foil from Planahanna which is the um supernatural quote overlays and then I also pulled in a birthday um sheet from planner pixie co as well and then because this whimsical plans kit i believe i don't honestly I, i've only purchased like two of her kits but i believe that this format is an older format and the washi was like the thick washi and it didn't come with an extra washi strip like i know her kits do now so i pulled in some extra bottom washi from a scroll of prince co because it had the washi and then it also had like a full box pat a patterned full box to use so I used that for one of the quotes and then in the sidebar I used like that big double box with the big quote like the carry on my wayward son quote I folded that in half so I kind of was able to use three boxes in one in the sidebar so like with an extender kind of so I'm glad the way that turned out because I did have Colton pick out which full boxes he wanted to use and which overlays excuse me which overlays went where because I didn't I mean I don't watch Supernatural so I don't know who these characters are who said what quote what relates to what and like kind of what's important like if I were to plan this spread out myself I would have excluded that pie piece because I think the colors are a little bit brighter than the you know like there's no red in the kit so and I thought that was a little distracting but he was like he was that was like the first thing he picked out he was like oh you have to have the pie which again shows that I don't even watch this show and I obviously don't know what's important which is one of the reasons why I had him pick out which boxes and which overlays he wanted to use um, because they mean more to him than they do to me so I did that and then I also pulled in some scripts and whatnot and functional items all in silver to kind of pull in that silver and then I also used the black when I could because sometimes you know black on black sometimes it doesn't always work, work well although this foil is I don't want to say shimmery because it's not but it's foil so it, it has some sort of shine to it which sometimes makes it easier to see against you know like in a monochrome setting so anyway yeah oh and the underlays were also black from the foil bundle and I think that again brings in the mood and kind of brings everything together in a way so yeah, I guess you can't tell. I'm very happy with the way this spread turned out, even though it's very different than what I normally do. And it's with a kit format that I was not very familiar with, actually not familiar with at all because it was an older format. And it also was from a shop that I don't really shop from that often, but I did make it work. And I don't actually, I'm briefly looking over my spread and I don't think I pulled in anything that wasn't from the kit I think I was able to make it work and I think the reason for that was because I did purchase the glitter header add-on that like sheet that had the glitter headers and then it had a whole bunch of other functional items with the glitter header um texture like that glitter texture and I think if I didn't purchase that I would not have been able to make this a complete spread because a lot of the items were I don't want to say unusable but weren't ones that I'm familiar with using so it definitely would have been a lot harder to work with if I didn't have that extra add-on so I'm glad I did that which also I knew I was going to because I the way I plan now is usually with glitter headers anyway so anyway that was enough of rambling I guess I'll get into the day by day so on Monday was a pretty normal Monday uh actually no it wasn't I don't know why I said that so well the only normal thing was that I watched YouTube in the morning but I did unpack a little bit because if you watched last week's plan with me, then you'd know we got back from a camping trip at Joshua Tree the night before. So this morning I kind of spent 
unwinding like you know you know how you kind of need like a break from a, a big break even though Joshua Tree was not a big break by any means we left Friday afternoon and got back Sunday night but you still need that like at least half day to decompress even after a weekend trip so did that uh, did a little bit of scrapbooking and then some filming and I believe I filmed a haul or something either way it must have been a big filming day because I organized stickers afterwards Colton and I did some wedding planning we watched Sila which I think this must be the first time we watched it because I don't remember marking it earlier at the time I'm doing this voiceover unfortunately the season has ended but we really liked it I typically don't watch the sci-fi shows that's not really my thing but I actually kind of enjoyed this one and the only reason why I started watching it was because Colton happened to be watching it in the same room and I kind of got hooked so it was a pretty good show I highly recommend it if you have Apple Plus um and then I ended the evening by reading moving on to Tuesday did some cleaning in the morning uh, a little bit of planning I typically do that on Mondays but I because of the weekend trip Tuesday kind of became my Monday this week so did some planning updated the budget did some work ran some errands filming and then finally we went to trivia like we usually do on Tuesdays on Wednesday I marked that SBC has new releases um, again I've mentioned this like every week but I do I try to use up the stickers that I have and because I had a silver SBC new releases sticker I decided to use it there's some more scrapbook scrapbooking I was kind of on a kick around this time uh, did some laundry filming and then we watched Ted Lasso which is the main reason why actually the only reason why we got Apple Plus Colton really wanted to watch it and we got it as we got a free month trial with some purchase for something else so we decided to keep it on because we were watching Ted Lasso and then started watching Silo and then started watching Hijack which you'll see in a couple weeks so a lot of good shows on Apple Plus and then again we did some wedding planning typically we do the wedding planning Wednesdays and Saturdays but it looks like this week we did it Monday Wednesday and not Saturday because that was Colton's birthday party so yeah um, and then we or I ended the evening by reading on Thursday I had fish lab coffee break in the morning with another lab mate uh, did some work um, went to run some errands basically went grocery shopping did a more cleaning I think we were prepping for the weekend that must be why I did a lot of cleaning this week uh, and even more scrapbooking wow definitely was on a kick oh because I mainly wanted to try to finish up I'm way behind I like literally just finished scrapbooking my 2022 my 2020 scrapbook and I do one or I do like at least two for every year maybe a third one if we took a big trip that year or something 2020 we didn't take a big trip at all um it was just the normal the normal um scrapbook because obviously we were kind of bunkered down as the rest of the world was in 2020 anyway uh we watched sharknado 6 so we finally finished the sharknado series that's one of the movies that we were or one of the movie series that we wanted to get through i've seen them before but colton hadn't so finally got through sharknado and then i read again in the evening surprise surprise on Friday I did some filming in the morning um, probably edited that same video um, did some work met with my advisor and we had Wiener Schnitzel for dinner or for lunch I'm not sure I think for lunch and then Colton and I um, caught up on some silo and then we had a movie night on Saturday ran some errands in the morning we went to Costco because we had to pick up some last-minute things for the party that evening uh again cleaned up for the party i did some scrapbooking i guess i had some free time in between cleaning in the party when people came over and then we had colton's birthday party which is basically a pool party in the backyard just a chill um barbecue hot dogs things like that and then sunday was actually colton's birth birthday so i wanted to mark that um and then we kind of slept in and had a lazy day i didn't have a sleep in sticker so i used the cuddle sticker instead whenever there's kind of a script like from a foil bunder or, some or something that's like tangentially related i'll use that instead uh talk to my parents like i usually do on sundays and then we or i did some laundry and then we went out for date night i'm assuming this was for colton's birthday dinner i think we went to the same restaurant that I chose for my birthday dinner last year um it's really good kind of expensive but I, we both really like it so yeah um and then uh, we ended the evening by doing some wedding planning I can't remember where we were at this point probably trying to book a photographer I think was where we were at this point but honestly I can't 
I can't remember. I don't mark down the specifics unless I have a sticker for it. <laughs> then I'll mark down the specifics that we did. But if I don't have a sticker specific for it, I'll just do a generic wedding plan. So that is pretty much everything for this week. In a second, you'll see all the stickers that I have left over from the kit, which really isn't Oh, I guess I had more than I thought I did, but um, that's all the stickers that I have left over. And then you'll see the final spread with all the scripts filled in and everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a good day. Bye-bye.